for the world. Continued generosity. And many thanks to all of you for being here at this for me very special day and very special event. If someone, if someone were to ask how being an activist has helped me, the answer would be that it has allowed for a greater understanding of the enormous power of the populace. Power for the benefit of administration and therefore institutions, businesses and people's rights. Power to preserve memory. Power to avoid forgetting. And also power itself because documents, because archive, are an extraordinary tool for the future. Allow me to briefly expand on these ideas. What has always struck me about people with the serious mental disorders, Alzheimer's, for example, is not only the inability to remember the past, but the ability to imagine the future. Their condemnation is to live only in the present. If we take this into the social sphere, it paints an extremely disturbing picture. Can we imagine a society condemned only to exist in the present? A society without memory, preventing from being able, being able to construct its own future. We know that individual memory is memory not only because it remembers, but fundamentally because it forgets. However, humanity, since ancient times, has fought against collective amnesia by building repositories of memory which ensure that coming generations are able to imagine their future. Archives accumulate millions of memories from the past which, over the centuries, preserve the memory of those who have preceded us and who generously offer us the permanent adventure of inventing our future. It is documents that allow us to know what others have already known, to see what others have already seen, to think what others have already thought. And those who will come after us will know, see and think many of the things that we now know, see and think. In August 2017, Business Insider estimated that the steel image produced worldwide that year would reach 1.2 trillion, or that is the same, 3,287 million per day. It's clear that in the face of this new reality, which affects documentary production as a whole, a continued review of our professional role is required. I'm convinced, however, that we will be able to respond to the challenge that we face, though we need to continually adapt our methodological tools because society demands it. Future. This is a word I have repeated quite a few times in this speech. We should have no doubt about it. Those of us who take care of the past must be at the power of the future, precisely because it's up to us to preserve our present. And it's no joke, because without documents, there is and there will not be knowledge. 
Perhaps everything would be better understood if adapting an old Hindu proverb would we convince ourselves that archives are not a gift from our parents, but a loan from our children. I understand by expressing my deep gratitude to MRDC Award Committee for this undeserved recognition, recognition I have received. When its president, Dr. Julie McLeod, conveys to me the result of its deliberations, my surprise was overwhelming. I really couldn't believe that my name would be added to that list of people I admire so much, such as Trudy Peterson, Laura Miller, Julie McLeod, Maria Bercio, Victoria Lemieux, Luciana Blanti, Adrian Cunningham, Simon Schroon, Anna Brown, Charles Dollar, Frank Evans, just to mention some of the colleagues who have been distinguished with this award, which stands 55 this year, and which continues to honor the memory of Emma Lehi, the activist and records manager. We must thank Professor Vicker and the representative here, Mrs. Ann King, for its commitment and willingness to continue supporting this award. Thank you. I also sincerely appreciate that we have joined, we have been joined by Mr. David Fricker, our joint president of the International Council on Archive. Je vais également remercier la présence de Madame Josephine, la nouvelle présidente du Conseil national des archives. Je vous souhaite, Madame, un grand succès, car euh, votre succès sera aussi le nôtre. Quiero agradecer también la presencia de Carlos Serrano, el nuevo director ejecutivo del Consejo General de Archivos y naturalmente le deseo y te deseo un gran éxito en estos próximos años. It's clear, it's clear for me that we have the impressive network that ICA offers us and we would not be here before you all at this moment. And of course, I appreciate the presence of Mr. Francesc Jiménez, President of the Association of Archives of Catalonia, who is here in the representation of Catalan professionals. Muchas gracias, Francesc, y muchas gracias a todos los colegas de Catalonia que voy a solicitar. Gracias.
Bueno, nosotros estamos muy, muy orgullosos, la verdad, es que es, es, es un premio que supongo que en otras disciplinas son más mediáticas y, y se hace muy, muy, muy razón, ¿no? pero están hablando del premio Nobel de la, de la, de la archivística ¿no? y es el primer, es el segundo europeo continental que, que en toda la historia de, de, del premio Awards, estoy hablando, que, que ha ganado este premio, pero a més a més a nivel mundial es el segundo que aconsegueix los dos premios, el de Premi Awards y el de Lika Follow, en mateix any, ¿no? I, i això és, és, bueno, no, no té precedents, no? I és el segon que ho aconsegueix i només, eh, i més a nivell d'Europa sí que és l'únic que ho ha aconseguit. I res, un, estem molt orgullosos que a nivell d'associació, més un soci, eh, un soci dels primers socis de l'associació, sí, el número 14, si no recordo malament, eh, o sigui que estem parlant de socis, y a més a més president, ex president de la asociación. Bueno, estem molt orgullosos quan ens ho van dir que guanyava Premi Awards. Em, 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 ens va comunicar que ara recordo el Joan Mateix Joan ens va trucar i em va dir, està, ostres, aquest premi és molt important, no? Eh, demostra que la salut de la de l'arxivística catalana està a ple nivell. No només per pel Joan, eh, per Girona, òbviament, perquè el que diu ell, i, i crec que és molt interessant, és que des d'una ciutat no capital d'allò de, de, s'ha aconseguit eh, arribar a, a tenir aquest prestigi internacional, no? ell com a, com, a, com a professional i tot l'equip que l'envolta. No? I això també diu molt de l'arxivística catalana. No? Yes, and she's doing better. She had an operation, so. Small problem, but she's doing okay. 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 She's doing ok